This is reason number 26 why you're being lazy as fuck with your build. Pissing rain, Washington State, two Corollas. So usually when you get these um, when you get these off right here down at the ball joint, uh, most people will have you take all this shit apart so you can kind of drop the control arm down. But if you put a big pry bar up through here, right at the base of the control arm, and you have somebody push it down, you can just lift up and pull it right up and off the top. And if you do it right, you won't bust up the bushing down here. So that's another one out. Yep. How to take a strut apart. Number two. Bad. That wasn't bad. <laughs> My dad was watching. <laughs> Safety first. <laughs> All right, and then back up. Oh fuck! <laughs> His shock just fell. <laughs> just falls. Oh, all, all right. right. Pull. Here, pull these. Well, actually, no, no, no. We just, well, just leave this like this. We just don't look at it. Fair enough. <laughs> my saddle. Dude, it's fucking mint. What do you mean? I just wiped my hand across to a razor blade on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, paper towels on stat, bro. I'm like 45 years old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This one's orange and green. The other one's green. So good. Alright, other shock time. It is indeed other shock time. Unless you want to spray blade cream in there. And... Pretty simple setup. They just have this upper ring that holds everything together. So you just make sure it's center. Screw it all down. Lock it down. I think tight is tight with these or something like that. That's all center. I don't think you could beat like uns. I would definitely.